Hi, this is Trace, and um, I'm going to do a second uh, video about The Voice, but um, since it's going to be premiering tomorrow night, um, only this time, um, I thought of a lot of times, um, I've been thinking about maybe, I don't know how long, maybe a year or two now since I auditioned for The Voice uh, back in 2017. I started thinking, hmm, these these people. I would love to. I would. I wish that I would be this co this celebrity. This musician can be on the Voice to be my coach. I would love that. So um, without, I'm not gonna. I'm not without. Uh, I'm not gonna say top ten, top five, whatever. I'm just gonna go ahead and say it. Which musicians do I would I love to see on the Voice, or I think would be good. Uh, the Voice coaches. Um, so the first one that comes to mind uh, is Brandon Murier from Panic at the Disco. Big fan of him. Love his voice. The way that he's one of the f he's one of the famous uh, male uh, vocalists who can sing alto so well. Maybe mezzo soprano, and he has a huge range. At the same time, um, he can sing any kind of genre of music. He's done Broadway because he was in Kinky Boots. He was in, on Broadway for a while, and then like years ago, I don't know, two, three, four years ago, I don't remember. Um, yeah. No, it's probably three, two, two, three years ago, I guess. And then he uh, he um, he does Freddie Mercury. He sang with Cisco, the thong song with him on Jimmy Kimmel Live. So that's there's your hip hop. So he can sing any kind of genre, and um, you know he does YouTube videos where he sings like Celine Dion, Whitney Houston. He's just amazing. Um, the next musician I would love to you know, see on The Voice, even if, uh, my, as my coach, dream coach, is Bruno Mars. Um, that man has been, he's practically born into music all his life. Music is all his life. Um, his, he has a band, um, was a, his family has a band in Hawaii when, since he was a kid. And, um, you know, he's very super talented. Other than singing, he can, you know, he can uh, play drums, uh, play piano, guitar, all kinds of, you know, mu uh, music. So I think he would be a great um, vocal, uh, the voice coach. And, um, yeah. Next celebrity I would love to see, um, Celine Dion. Celine Dion. Because um, if anybody knows who she, who she is, she's a legend since the 90s. And um, everybody knows that she's a trained singer. Again, like Bruno, she, Celine also came, um, was born into a family of musicians. So, and performed with her family. And then she went solo. And, you know, um, she's amazing. And especially vocal technique, she will do, do a great job coaching um, her whoever makes it on her team, especially vocal techniques and, you know, maybe express like stage presence and, you know, stuff like that. Um, even, uh, not that she's an actress, but I get a feeling that she can be, she's going to be good at um, getting in character of the song. Okay. I'm just thinking about Barbara Streisand. She's a legendary singer um, and she's done, you know, all kinds of things, pop. Um, and um, Broadway as well and you know sh she would be great be a great asset to the voice and I think that she will be open to um, all kinds of music from all um, decades and um, you know she, not only will she be she will, will she teach people how to um, good correct do good sing better t singing techniques but also stage presence and you know, uh, I also think I believe Taylor Swift was on the show to help um, mentor the, the, the contestants. Uh, I think she would be great too. Um, you know, singer-songwriter plays all these instruments. And um, she's done not just country, but nowadays she's more into the pop and music. So she can do different genres as well. And, um, you know, yeah, she should be on The Voice um, as a, a, a mentor, um, not mentor, but a coach. My other person who I feel would be great, um, I'm jealous of this person. She's just freaking perf 
perfect. She wins awards all the time. Um, and she's a former American Idol winner, just like Kelly Clarkson. And then I'm talking about Carrie Underwood. I, she's never been on The Voice at all. I mean, not even as a mentor, but she should. I think she, she, she should be on The Voice. She has what it takes. She can teach people, um, you know, how to win. You know, like sing technique or um, how to um, do, um, you know, like stage presence or, yeah. And she's she's done different kinds of music genre, not just country, but she was in Sound of Music Live as Maria. And so, yeah. Carrie Underwood, yep, absolutely. <laughs> Hmm. Earlier this evening, I was thinking about two two former boy band members who became soloists. One of them didn't the, his solo career did not um, was not too too successful, and I'm talking about Nick Lachey. I I think he would be a great um, asset on The Voice. He has a great voice, and he he was. Um, he did well enough to go solo, um, even though his first album was a disaster. The second one is better, um, but um, I, I think he should be on The Voice. Um, uh, and, um, yeah, <laughs> another person, um, Justin Timberlake, he's never been on The Voice, not even mentor anybody on the show, but unlike Nick Lachey, his solo career, it went just skyrocketed. And he knows what it takes to succeed in the business, um, what sells records, albums, you know, probably teach people how to stage presence, um, how to sell a song, you know, through the performance, vocal technique, whatever. Justin Timberman, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Anybody else? I'm thinking about more people. I was thinking Billie Eilish. Um, you know, because um, she's still, you know, she's still, um, you know, a big star since she came out, well, either last year or two years ago now. Um, Billie Eilish, I was thinking Billie Eilish. Hmm. I can't think of anybody else. Mariah Carey, one season, she did mentoring for a while, I think during the, the battle rounds uh, in one episode. Um, I think my, Mariah Carey should be on the show as a... Uh, as a coach, um, as any, as I've, all of us, you know, American Idol fans back in the, the original American Idol and Fox Network, you know, she was one of the judges, um, and I, I think she would, she would make make a great coach, on the Voice uh, with singing technique, and again, she knows how to sell albums. So hope you know, I'm sure she, uh, she'll find ways to help her, her team, um, do well. Uh, win, you know, do what they need to do to learn to, you know, perform and sell albums <laughs> uh, once the show the show is over. Um, I can't think. Gosh, I'm blanking out. Um, I, there's so many wonderful singers that I can think of. Um, lots from different time periods and stuff like that. Summer. Oh, I know, I know, I know. She, and she, yes, she did appear on The Voice when her godchild, Miley Cyrus, was on the show, and she appeared twice on uh, Miley's season, I think back in 2017, yes. Um, and that is Dolly Parton. She's a legendary, you know, um, she's a legendary country singer. And, um, you know, I think she, um, she would be a hoot to be on the show. She's such a, she's such a gem. <laughs> Love mm. her. And you know she has a, this bubbly personality and stuff like that, and I, you know, I get a feeling that she would make a great uh, vo voice coach, very encouraging to the people who end up making it in her team, and you know, yeah. <laughs> Anything else? Um, gosh, I don't know what else to say. Um, oh, wait a minute, hi, hey, time out. <laughs> okay, now I just thought two more singers. Um, um, like I mentioned before in the, um, in my voice audition experience video, I was mentioning that um, uh, all the all of us potential contestants in the waiting area were singing uh, Ed Sheeran's song. So yes, of course, I, I would love to see Ed Sheeran be a 
of the voice coach. Um, he's amazing. And um, yeah, <laughs> love him. And I would love to be on his team. <laughs> um, and, and, you know, you know he, what, I, what I admire about him is like, I didn't know that his struggles before making it big um, in the music industry and I didn't know he was homeless and stuff like that. So I think that's amazing that, you know, uh, he never gave up hope, you know, and he, he, he does, you know, I believe that he's going to be very encouraging to the contestants and be an inspiration to um, his team. And, um, yeah, <laughs> another person, I just forgot the second person. Oh, my God. I was also thinking about Sean Mendez. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I don't know why I'm thinking about this person. I like Shania Twain. She's, she's cool. Um, I haven't seen her for a very long time. She, um, I, I know she did Vegas for a while. Um, I think she would be, make a great um, voice coach as well. Anyone else? I can't think of anybody else, you know, on top of my head. Um, you know, I, well, you know what? Um, I was thinking about, for some reason, I was thinking, you know, Justin Bieber did appear on the show within the first year, I think, of the show, or first season, or second season, maybe. But um, I, I think that Justin Bieber, you know, would be a good voice coach. Um, and um, he still has a fan base, despite of the, all the stuff, bad, bad boy stuff he used to do um, years ago, a few years ago, whatever. And, um, you know, it'll be, it's, it's really good that he's trying to clean up his act, and um, he's settling down, he's married, and, um, you know, he's pretty much back in track, and, you know, so um, I think he would be a really good voice coach. Um, after all, um, he was the former, he was a... Um, how do you say that um, Usher discovered him I guess <laughs> and um, he was so good when he was a kid that um, I believe uh, even Justin Timberlake was fighting the right to have the have Justin Bieber under his, their wing, his wing too so um, I think he would be a good voice coach you know and he deserves a break you know and like a second chance and all that stuff Anything else? I think that's about it that I can think of um, if you watch this video, um, what do you think of my choices? Um, and um, if you want to say, oh, I'd love to hear from you guys too. Um, what do you think of, if there are any, uh, any other musicians you would love to see be the uh, coach on The Voice, let me know in the comments below. Okay, see you next time on my next video. Bye.